What we're going to do first is make sure that the electrical impedances are okay. They were in the operating room, we just want to make sure they are now. Everything looks good still. All right. So everything is where it needs to be. Nothing is open circuited or short circuited. All right. Well, that's good. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and use your Rondo speech processor. That's the all in one processor. Um, which you may find that you wear more than the other one. You, you're going to get two types of processors today, this Rondo, and then you also get one that looks that goes behind the ear, right. But this is the Rondo put to my computer. So we're going to try this one first. I may have to go to a stronger magnet. All right. I want you to listen. You're going to hear you're you're going to hear some beeps with your good ear, but I want you to concentrate on what you're hearing here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put some current in. I don't think you're going to be hearing much softer than this. I want you to just listen for some beeping sounds, okay? And you all will hear some beeps too, but it's not the same as what he's hearing. You hear that with your good ear? Are you hearing anything in this ear? Does it sound loud, soft, or medium? Okay, and I'm going to make it louder. You hear it getting louder? Yeah. Is it too loud or good? Okay. Still okay. Still okay? All right. Okay. Would you like it louder or do you think that's loud enough for now. I think it's good. Okay. All right. Okay. Great. Now I'm going to let you listen to a few other electrodes and just make sure it's comfortable on those. Okay? Do you hear that? Yeah. Is that okay? Yeah. Make it a little bit louder? Yes. That's pretty good? Yeah, that's good. Yeah. Okay. Now this is going to be a lower pitched one. Okay, you hear that? Is that pretty good? Yeah. It's quite soft. Quite soft. You want me to try to make it a little bit louder? Okay. No, that's fine. That's good right yeah. there. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Tomorrow when you come back, we'll probably be able to make these a little bit louder. When you're first starting to hear this way, you can't tolerate a whole lot, yeah. and that's fine. Okay, we'll measure a few more. Okay, this is going to be very high pitched. Do you hear that? Yeah. Okay. No, it's too loud. Now. Too loud now. Okay, I'm going to drop it back a little bit. Tell me no, when that's you. Fine. That's good right there. Okay. Okay. And then this is your very lowest pitch electrode. Is that all right? Let me to drop it down a little bit. That's good. Right there. Okay, that's comfortable. Okay. All right. I'm going to ask you to listen to each one of these. They're just going to sweep across. So you can actually watch the numbers up here and tell me if any of them sound too loud or if any of them seem just really soft compared to the others. Okay? All right. Eleven was 
to load. Okay. All right. Was that better? Yeah. You think they sound pretty good? Yeah, a bit on the louder side. Bit on all the louder of, side, all, all of them. them? Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay, how about this? A little bit loud? Yeah. Okay. We can keep coming down a little bit. All right. I'm going to start talking to you, okay? Um, just let me know if you think it sounds too loud, and I'll stop it right away. Again, it's going to sound very different from what you're used to hearing. Okay. Can you hear me? One, two, three, four, five. Yes, I can, but it's like... Is it far away? Yeah, Is it it's soft? Like soft, very soft. Okay, we will make it louder. Okay, mm -hmm. I've made that louder. Yeah, that's, that's better. Okay, how does your wife sound and your father? Y'all talk to him. Guess your voice out of you. Yeah, it's... Uh, naturally, it's not... Uh, the same as uh, I'm hearing from this, but yeah, it's going to be different for a while till your brain kind of gets used to it. Like in dono, was it mesh kar sakre? Are they meshing together or not? Mm, not really. really. No. They it's, they will. No. They will with time. But, they yeah, but them. not right away. It's going to be. It's two different kinds of hearing. So two different inputs. Like in the, it comf is it a comfortable feeling or yeah. is it something disturbing? It's, no, it's not disturbing, but it's. It's a tinnitus. Tinnitus ka kya wati kuvi hai kani? And the pressure in your ear that you were feeling all that was already gone. So. Oh, good. So the tinnitus was already gone? No, the pressure. The, the pressure. pressure yeah, the mm -hmm. tinnitus. So it's, it, mm -hmm. it's much better, yeah. It's much better. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, better. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, much better. Yeah. 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 It helps the tinnitus yes. a lot. Yes. I'm sure mm -hmm. a lot. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I can see the smile on his face. What we can do over time is um, make you different programs. Like, for example, if you wanted to, if you like to listen to music, of course you're going to be listening to music with your good ear. But um, you also can listen with your implant. Um, and we might need to make a map that has more bass emphasis or more mid frequency emphasis or, to make music the most enjoyable. So, do you have? Anything here with you, um, not today, but here with you in the U.S. that you use to listen to music, or do you even like to listen to music? Yeah, yeah. I have on a USB. Okay. We can play that on the computer. Okay. All right. So we can we can do some of that, and maybe um, you know make a map specially for music. Um, we can make a map that's better for listening and noise. Maybe we'll just we'll just try some different things. Right. It's going to be interesting for me too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. All right. Actually, one of his main problem was that in a meeting, mm -hmm. he couldn't really understand because so many voices were coming from different right. directions, and he has to get confused in that. Mm -hmm. So since he's a banker basically, and he has to attend a lot of meetings, so I think there has to be something which is more compatible with that mm -hmm. kind of atmosphere where lots of people are talking right. on a table, and uh, right. he would be able to differentiate. Well, just just having two ears up and running again mm -hmm. will help a lot with it's that. True. True. But then we may be able to adjust the frequency mm -hmm. emphasis mm -hmm. a little bit more on his implant side. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and take this off. Is it is it different than what you anticipated? Uh, not really, because I have been reading a lot about it on the okay. internet and talking to uh, people who've already on the net. Right. So I, I do understand it's for the first four, maybe three, four months, it's, yes. it's slowly going to right. be, get better with time. Is it louder so, than what you thought it would be? Or uh, is it... Uh, let's see how this mm, yeah, not, not really louder, but I think it's good. And But definitely it has helped with the tinnitus. Well, yeah. that's the main reason. That's a that's a yeah. wonderful yeah. thing. That's a wonderful yeah. thing. Yeah, that's a that's a great, that's a great thing. thing. That's mm -hmm. very great. Yes, and it's it's 
I think patients with tinnitus are the best patients mm -hmm. because the tinnitus is so disabling for them, mm -hmm. and it really helps. In fact, in Europe, and some of the some the of the some of the studies require that the patient have tinnitus. I mean, it's that, it's almost a requirement that they do have, which is not a problem because the majority of them do. But um, studies have shown that the best patients are the ones who are significantly bothered by tinnitus because the implant helps it so much. Yeah. In fact, in Pakistan, he was not bothered about losing his hearing. He was more bothered about the tinnitus, tinnitus absolutely. because that used to really play up like a big engine running in sure. his ear all the time. Right. And that was very disturbing. Absolutely. So, yeah. in fact, we said if that goes away, we'll be more than satisfied. Well. But by the grace of God, I think everything has turned out very well. Yes. Mm -hmm. So is the tinnitus completely gone or just much, much less? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, it's not much less because there are other sounds coming in, so it's masked in those right. sounds. Yeah. Okay, good. Yeah. good. Will that get better, Elizabeth, the tinnitus masking? It should. It should. I mean, again, I mean, I think that's probably an individual thing. Right. We can hope. Sure. Sure. <laughs> good. So. I, I think that should be a good data for you. Sure. <laughs> to Absolutely. start off with. Mm -hmm. It's really amazing how the science has advanced. It is. It is. It's, it's incredible. It is. It is. Some years back, I think uh, it could not even have been imagined. I know. I know. Well, hearing is the first of the five senses to be exactly. replaced by technology. Yes. And, and you realize the importance when you lose something. Absolutely. Otherwise, we take it for granted everything. You're right. You know, but uh, when you lose it, then you really find that what is the importance of it in your life. That's right. So I can see the smile on his face. Sudden hearing loss is... Um, uh, They're becoming quite common now. Well, you know, it's it's... It's it's a it's a well recognized problem uh, in our specialty, and um, we still don't really understand why it happens mm -hmm. to a lot of people. Um, the the leading theory is viral, yeah. a viral infection, but uh, we you know we don't know for sure in a lot of cases. But um, a number of cases do come back. The hearing may come back mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. if it's, if it's a milder loss. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, his did not, so... Mm -hmm. At least we have things that can help now. That's right. Mm -hmm.